If you are currently in a relationship and find yourself having regrets about dating your partner, it is important to reflect on what may be causing these feelings. It could be that you are not compatible with your partner, or it might be something else entirely. Whatever the case may be, it is important to be honest with yourself so that you can make the best decision for your future. Why do we have regrets in our current relationship with someone? We all have regrets in our current relationships. Sometimes we regret dating someone who we are currently in a relationship with because they didn't turn out to be who we thought they were. Other times, we might regret not dating someone because we realize that we are actually compatible with them. It's important to communicate with your partner about your regrets so that you can work through them together. By doing this, you can learn from your mistakes and make your relationship even stronger. We all have regrets in our relationships with others and we often wonder why we got ourselves into the situation in the first place. We might regret dating someone who isn't good for us or becoming too involved too quickly. We may even regret staying in a relationship that isn't right for us. All of these things are normal and happen to almost everyone at one point or another in their lives. The key is to learn from your mistakes and not repeat them in the future. Talk to your friends and family about what you are going through and get their advice. They might have been through something similar and can help you figure out what to do. You can also read articles or books about relationships to gain more insight. If you are having regrets about dating someone, the best thing to do is talk to him or her about it. Be honest about your feelings and explain why you are having second thoughts. If the two of you are on the same page, you can work together to figure out a solution. But if not, it might be best to end the relationship before it causes more pain. There are many factors that can cause us to regret dating someone. Maybe we were too quick to judge and didn't give the person a chance. Maybe we ignored red flags and swept them under the rug. Whatever the case may be, regrets are a normal part of the dating process. But that doesn't mean we have to wallow in them. Here are a few tips for moving on from your dating regrets. 1. Learn from your mistakes. Regrets can be painful, but they can also be a learning experience. Take some time to reflect on what went wrong in the relationship and what you could have done differently. This will help you avoid making the same mistakes in future relationships. 2. Don't dwell on the past. It's easy to get caught up in what might have been, but dwelling on your regrets will only make you feel worse. Instead, Focus on the present and future. What can you do to make your current relationship better? What are you looking forward to in your life? 3. Forgive yourself. We all make mistakes, so there's no need to beat yourself up over your dating regrets. Give yourself some grace and forgiveness and move on. 4. Talk to someone you trust. If you're struggling to let go of your regrets, talk to a friend or family member who will understand and support you. Sometimes it helps to talk about our problems in order to gain some perspective. 5. Seek professional help. If your regrets are causing you a lot of distress, it might be time to seek professional help. A therapist can help you work through your emotions and make peace with your past. We all have regrets in our relationships with someone. It's a natural part of life. But why do we have them? And how can we prevent them from happening? There are many reasons why we might have regrets in our relationships. Maybe we didn't listen to our partner when they needed us. Maybe we said something hurtful during an argument. Or maybe we just didn't make the effort we should have to keep the relationship strong. Whatever the reason, regrets can cause a lot of pain and damage to our relationships. They can make us question whether or not we're really meant to be with someone, and they can lead to breakups or divorce. So how can we prevent regrets from happening? By being more mindful of our words and actions, and by making a conscious effort to be the best partner we can be. We can change the past, but we can learn from our mistakes and strive to do better in the future. We might have regrets because we didn't listen to our partner when they needed us. We might have regrets because we said something hurtful during an argument. We might have regrets because we just didn't make the effort we should have to keep the relationship strong. We might have regrets because we ignored red flags or we were too quick to judge. We might have regrets because we got too involved too quickly. We might have regrets because we stayed in a relationship that wasn't right for us. All of these things are normal and happen to almost everyone at one point or another in their lives. The key is to learn from your mistakes and not repeat them in the future. Talk to your friends and family about what you are going through and get their advice. They might have been through something similar and can help you figure out what to do. You can also read articles or books about relationships to gain more insight. If you are having regrets about dating someone, the best thing to do is talk to him or her about it. Be honest about your feelings and explain why you are having second thoughts. If the two of you are on the same page, you can work together to figure out a solution. But if not, it might be best to end the relationship before it causes more pain. How to deal with regret in a relationship We've all been there before. You're in a relationship and things just aren't working out. Maybe you had different expectations for the relationship. 
or maybe you're just not compatible with each other. Whatever the reason, you may find yourself feeling regretful about dating someone you're in a relationship with. If you're struggling with regret in your relationship, here are some tips to help you cope. 1. Acknowledge your feelings It's okay to feel regretful about the situation you're in. Don't try to bottle up your emotions, allow yourself to feel them and process them in a healthy way. 2. Talk to your partner about your feelings If you're feeling regretful about the relationship, it's important to communicate this to your partner. They may not be aware of how you're feeling, and it's important to have an open and honest conversation about your concerns. 3. Seek professional help if needed If you're finding it difficult to cope with your feelings of regret, it may be helpful to seek professional counseling or therapy. This can provide you with additional support and guidance as you work through your emotions. 4. Make a decision about the future of the relationship Once you've processed your feelings, it's time to make a decision about the future of the relationship. If you don't think the relationship is right for you, it may be best to end things. However, if you're willing to work on the relationship, there are steps you can take to improve things between you and your partner. 5. Let go of the past It's important to remember that everyone makes mistakes, including you. Don't dwell on the things that have gone wrong in the relationship, and instead focus on the present and the future. 6. Talk to a trusted friend or family member Sometimes it can be helpful to talk to someone else about your regrets. This can help you get some outside perspectives and it can also help you figure out what you want to do next. 7. Write down your thoughts If you are having trouble processing your thoughts, writing them down can be helpful. This can help you organize your thoughts and figure out what is causing your feelings of regret. 8. Give yourself time It is important to give yourself time to process your emotions. If you are feeling regretful, try not to make any rash decisions. Take some time to think about things, and then you can decide what you want to do next. 9. Don't be too hard on yourself. Remember that everyone makes mistakes and that you are not alone in feeling regretful about a relationship. Try to be understanding and forgiving of yourself, and focus on moving forward. 10. Don't give up on yourself or your relationship. If you're feeling regretful, it's important to remember that you can make things better. Talk to your partner about your feelings, and work together to improve your relationship. What are the difficult moments in a relationship when we regret being there? There are definitely difficult moments in every relationship when we may regret being there. However, we usually don't realize it until we're already in the midst of it. It's during these trying times when we question ourselves and our decisions. We wonder if we made a mistake by getting into the relationship in the first place. We might even start to think that we're not good enough for our partner. All of these doubts can lead to a feeling of regret. It's important to remember that every relationship has its ups and downs. There will be good times and bad times. If we only focus on the negative, then it's easy to lose sight of why we're even in the relationship in the first place. Whenever we start to have doubts, it's important to take a step back and remember the positive aspects of our partner and the relationship. This can help us push through the tough times and come out stronger on the other side. Some difficult moments in a relationship when we may regret being there include when we have a major disagreement or fight, when our partner does something that hurts us deeply, when we feel like we're not being appreciated or valued, when we start to doubt our own worthiness in the relationship. If we can remember the good moments and why we're in the relationship in the first place, then we can push through the tough times and come out stronger on the other side. There are difficult moments in every relationship when we may regret being with our partner. Perhaps we had an argument and said things we didn't mean, or we might be feeling neglected and unimportant. Whatever the case may be, these are the moments when we start to question our decision to be in a relationship with this person. It's normal to have doubts and feel like you made a mistake at times, but it's important to remember that every relationship has its ups and downs. The key is to communicate with your partner and work through the tough times together. If you're always questioning your decision to be with someone, it might be time to reassess your relationship and see if it's really right for you. May God help and guide you in Jesus' name. Amen.